top story tonight. A prestigious Newark private school fires a well-respected administrator for alleged inappropriate conduct. That's right. News 12 New Jersey's Keith Kaczynski is in Newark with details. Yes, yeah, so we're outside of St. Benedict's Prep here in Newark, where a well-respected college guidance counselor by the name of Didier Jean-Baptiste was fired for what administrators deem as inappropriate conduct. Now, in a statement from the school, they say earlier this morning, we were made aware of inappropriate conduct off of school property involving an adult lay member of the St. Benedict's Prep community. This event did not involve any St. Benedict's students. Now, immediate action was taken to terminate the employment of this individual, as well as ensure law enforcement was apprised. Though no current or former students were involved and the event did not occur on school grounds, an internal investigation has already begun. We were outside the home of Mr. Jean Baptiste earlier today as representatives from the Hudson County Prosecutor's Office, Jersey City and Harrison Police paid him a visit. They talked to someone inside. We're unsure of the identity of that individual. Uh, they talked to them between five to ten minutes and left. However, in a statement from the Hudson County Prosecutor's Office, they say this matter is under investigation by the Hudson County Prosecutor's Office Special Victims Unit and the Harrison Police Department. They say no arrests have been made or charges have been filed at this point. That's disgusting because he's, he's a grown man texting a little kid who said he's 14, year old, 14 years old. I heard she was talking to a 14 year old. Mm -hmm. What are your thoughts about that? As a parent uh, who has a child that will soon turn, for, turn 14 and who has another minor who is six, 17 years old, it sickens me to my stomach. Before police arrived at Mr. Jean Baptiste's home, we knocked on his door in an attempt to get a comment from him, but we were told by someone inside that he wasn't present. With the latest here in Newark, I'm Keith Kosinski, News 12, New Jersey.